Everyone should have some kind of colorectal cancer screening routine by the age of 50, even sooner if you have a family history or other risk factors. Colorectal cancer is the second leading cause of cancer death in the United States. It affects both men and women. Screening is the best way to detect the cancer early, when treatment is most effective. There are three screening methods that work. Colonoscopy, sigmoidoscopy, and the home stool test. Each of these methods has pros and cons. You can use this website to investigate the options and identify your preference. Then you and your doctor can decide which plan is right for you. It's sort of like, oh, yeesh, you know, you're going to do what to me, where, with what kind of a device? You just hear the word colonoscopy and you're like, oh, I don't want to go through that. I didn't want to do the stool test because I thought it was just gross. The sigmoidoscopy seemed embarrassing. How far are they going in and like uh, can they cause more damage than them, any benefit that I'm getting out of? But I was getting information from people who hadn't had the procedure done when I decided well I need to find out for myself. I mean if somebody did tell me you're gonna have to drink that nasty stuff. But I said can I put some sugar in this? <laughs> they said no! There is a big screen there, so you can actually watch your own colonoscopy. I'm not one of those people. I just, you know, get me in, put me on the slab, do the thing, and get me out. Okay, how am I going to get poop on a stick? <laughs> uh, everybody was saying that my gas sounded like a truck horn. <laughs> but I didn't mean to be that graphic, but it's the truth. The stool test was not as gross as I thought it was going to be. I was so surprised how painless it was. You think to yourself, why did I agonize over that? I think I worried over nothing. My goal is to be as healthy for as long as possible. Boy, I want to live to be 100, maybe a little more if I stop eating ice cream.